I'm Tom Wilson, I'm a grounds person at Aston Villa Football Club. I left school, I didn't have a clue what I wanted to do, so I, I like, got through a couple of j different jobs, landscape gardening, I went into work in a factory, then loads of other bits. Went, then I went to college, did PE for two years, but then realised that wasn't really for me. Saw an opportunity at York City, my local football club, as an apprentice grounds person, and obviously be, I'd done a bit of landscape gardening, which is completely different, but in kind of the same industry. So I took that job on, absolutely loved it, was there for nearly three years I think and then just progressed from there really, worked on a golf course for two years, I moved up to Durham sorry, for three years. It was obviously learning on the job, it was something new for me that I'd never experienced before, I wasn't just going to work nine to five, just getting the job done and that, you were learning as you went really. And, obviously gave me the opportunity to start a proper career and not just a nine to five job you don't enjoy and then got the job at Villa. I'd say it was more varied in the job I'm in now because you've got all the lights to bring in. There's more money at the Premier League club because you're at the top highest level so you've got more fertilizers to put on, obviously cutting every day. But yeah, I absolutely love it. Yeah, so one of the main advantages to doing an apprenticeship, I'd say, is you're not just sat in a classroom like five days a week. You're working and le like learning at college and learning on the job at the same time. So I, I can't see anything better, really. I'm Carl Prescott, Ed Graham's manager, Aston Villa Football Club. It all come about. Tom applied for a job about 18 months ago now. Uh, he'd got. The experience we were looking for with qualifications um, that he'd gained through going to college um, hadn't got um, spraying but it was something that as a club we were more than happy to, to put him through which he's gone on past that and various other qualifications as well since um, but yeah it was, it was the enthusiasm that he got for the job and his past experience as well which come across as you know being one of the big uh, big plus points as well for me I was in the same uh, position as Tom uh, 21 years ago now uh, which yeah I've, I've seen a lot but look it's one of them professions that you cannot be the whole match day experience um, just the whole thing of preparing the pitch making sure that it's as good as it possibly can be and there's nothing better than going home on a, on a Saturday night after a game and looking back at what you've helped produce. And I just think it's, for me, there's no other profession out there. I'm Chris Wood um, and I'm the trainer coach for Greenkeeping and Sports Turf at East Durham College. Tom completed a level two sports turf qualification uh, with myself at uh, East Durham College a couple of years ago. Um, and it's been great to watch his progress since then. Um, it's great to see the progress that's when, when people go on to higher things. So we've got various students at the college who've uh, completed greenkeeping and sports turf programs and then they've gone on to higher levels in the head greenkeeper jobs. Well, the, the best part of this job is when you've got everything cut up on a match day, ready ready for the game, the goals are in, there's no players making a mess of it or anything and you go up to the top of the gantry here and look down and you just, you're proud in what you've like put put together and then you watch match of the day on a night and see the pitch, it's, it's brilliant.